Sahar says, if a woman leaves her husband's house intending to divorce, where does she spend her idda once she divorces him? Or uh, um, does she file for khul' as she cannot go back to his house for idda? This is something that Allah mentioned in the Quran. And Allah gave us the answer to this. A woman is divorced once or twice. And these are called revocable divorces, meaning that the husband has the right to revoke the divorce and reconcile and they can get back together while she is in the waiting period, the idda period, we call it in Arabic. If he divorces her for the third time, it's over. Game is over. She cannot stay in the home. She cannot see him or mix with him because he becomes a total uh, non-mahram to her on the spot, he said, the third divorce. In the first and second revocable divorces, she's obliged to stay home. Sheikh, he just divorced her. Even though she has to stay the period of idda, which is three monthly cycles, generally speaking, for normal people who are not pregnant and who still have their menses. Three monthly periods. She stays home. And their husband and wife, they have full right to talk, to see one another, to mix, sleep in the same room, but without any intimacy. Why? Because Allah said in the Quran, to the men, do not take them out of their homes after divorce, nor they should leave. So this is an instruction. They should stay home. Why? Allah says in the Quran, you never know. Maybe something will come up. What does that mean? Maybe akhi, after the divorce, a couple of weeks later, I'm, I'm enraged, I'm angry with my wife. After a couple of weeks, I see her in my house, in my bed, and I remember the good old times. And then I think to myself, what I've done? She's a good woman. I start to see the good things in her. And then maybe I kiss and make up. That's it. So the divorce is revocable. One down, two to go. We resume our lives. Maybe we continue to be in this marriage happily ever after. So this is one of the reasons. But at the end of the day, this is what Allah commanded. So you cannot leave your home. You have to stay there. If you decide to go and stay at your parents' house, then you are sinful. If he forces you not to go back, then he is sinful. But this does not impact the divorce.